are here to celebrate the expansion of one of our city's most popular and revered institutions, the Whitney Museum of American Art. And as you can tell, and as you would expect, this is not going to be your average groundbreaking. In fact, it may be the most groundbreaking groundbreaking you'll ever see. Today, this area is, if you walk around, full of new hotels and shops and residential buildings. And I will say, it was the Whitney really saw the potential in the neighborhood long before any of that happened. So they really are at the edge. They are what we would call cutting edge or avant-garde. And let's not forget, this museum's roots are really downtown because the Whitney started, a little known fact, on 8th Street with a crazy idea that American art was something significant, not just the leftover ideas of a movement happening elsewhere. And that American artist had a unique way of seeing and engaging with their neighborhoods and with the world. And I think you can certainly say that about New Yorkers. Now, all of us who love New York and feed on the vitality of a place that is constantly in motion and always reinventing itself have a great appreciation for our city's unique blend of old and new, traditional and modern, past and future. And all of these elements will intersect and coexist in this very spot. And now to kick off the official groundbreaking of the new Whitney Building, I give you Breaking Ground, a performance by internationally acclaimed and Brooklyn-based choreographer Elizabeth Streb and the Streb Extreme Action Company.